Hi there, welcome to the Beaten Trail, and in this episode, we are finally getting new tires for our Razor Trail. And uh, these Tusk Terabytes just showed up, and they are beautiful. So we waited a while, uh, we really wanted to see how the stock tires were doing, and they were just not really performing, and we had a lot of damage on sidewalls. So just, uh, but these are beautiful, as you can see, these are Tusk Terabytes, 27, 11, 12s. And they are wider than what we had. Uh, we were originally concerned that they may rub a little bit. I've only had a little bit of rubbing on one of the McNasty protectors under compression, but not much. Uh, you know, we just really enjoy going out on the trail. We do a little bit of mud. We do a little bit of water. Nothing really more than a foot or two deep. Uh, it's nothing really uh, overly extreme. We're not doing extreme rock climbing. We're doing a little bit here and there, and really, we just wanted tires that were going to give us some good performance, some good grip. I don't frequent sand, although in the future we probably would uh, need to look into that if we lived in South New Jersey. But here, as you can see, just going out in Pennsylvania, it's just rocky and it's muddy. We got these uh, from Rocky Mountain ATV, and we'll put a link into the description. And as as you can see. This is a spare uh, on one of our rear tires, and just because we had we got such a nasty sidewall cut, that in our next episode we'll put up a extreme tire repair with some tire jacked patch and sealant. Uh, but this tire here on the rear uh, was one of two that we had gotten flats out out at uh, Darkwater, and uh, so we it was time to get new tires. You know, really, to have good tires is important, and I, I guess we assumed too much that six plies were really going to be protected enough uh, from rock, and uh, so the new ones are eight ply. I know you can get Kevlar <laughs> ten, ten uh, ply, and these are DOT rated, so they're really good, and they're handy to have when you're going to be uh, possibly going on the highway or on the road or local roads. That way you're in compliance, but we like the way they look a little bit wider maybe another inch bigger and you know just to really have a good reliable set of tires they don't have to worry about we still always carry spare we always recommend you carry spare uh, we carry slime uh, these tough terabytes i had uh, installed with slime so any small punctures they should really be okay uh, but uh, just for some serious uh, punctures, you know, you definitely want to make sure you have the, pu uh, the plug and patch kit and everything handy to do that. And these tires are rated for medium and hard terrain, so I think we'll be doing okay with these. But, um, you know, we wanted to show you that it's a nice stance. She sits well. Again, very minimal rubbing on one side because of the McNasties. But, you know, definitely good grip, good acceleration. They're not too much heavier. You know, we really are enjoying, um, you know, doing some downhills and loose gravel and dirt. Uh, they do like to pick up some rocks and toss them uh, under speed, but that's fine with us. Uh, but overall, uh, if you have any questions, please post them in the comments. We uh, are glad that you're joining us and you're watching uh, the video we put together. If you have any suggestions or what you'd like to see, let us know. But please subscribe, like our video, and uh, we hope to see you out there on the trail. Thanks again.